This is going to be a very quick video on primary versus secondary cells. Cells are devices that add electrical potential energy to charges moving through them. They add voltage or EMF. They do this using chemical reactions in the cell. There are two types of cells, primary cells and secondary cells. Primary cells are non-rechargeable. Once the cell gives up all its energy, the chemicals cannot react again. So some examples of that are just everyday batteries, specifically zinc carbon cells, and basically any battery that is non-rechargeable is a primary cell. In comparison to that, a secondary cell is rechargeable. Once the cell gives up all its energy, the chemical reaction that causes it to lose energy can be reversed by a charger, giving it more energy to use in circuits. So some examples are zinc carbon cells, car batteries, really anything that's rechargeable, things like your phone battery, laptop battery. Those are all examples of secondary cells because if you pass a current through them, they can be recharged. So in a primary cell, chemical energy can be converted to electrical potential energy, but electrical energy cannot be converted back into chemical energy because the cell cannot be recharged. In comparison, in a secondary cell, chemical energy is converted to electrical energy and electrical energy is converted back into chemical energy. So what this means is we can use electrical energy to charge secondary cells. We can use voltage to charge these types of batteries. So when you plug your phone into the wall to charge, you're converting electrical energy into chemical energy in your phone's battery to be used later. So that can happen in a secondary cell, but not in a primary cell. In a primary cell, electrons flow from the negative end to the positive end as the cell adds electrical energy. So they're repelled by the negative end and attracted to the positive end. So the electrons go in this direction toward the positive, and because the conventional current points in the opposite direction of the electrons, it goes from positive to negative. And this happens too in secondary cells, but the difference between primary and secondary cells is that when the secondary cells are being recharged, they're recharged by pushing electrons through the cell in the opposite direction that they would normally travel, adding more chemical energy into the cell than before. So when a secondary cell is being recharged, the electrons will actually be pushed from positive to negative, not because they're attracted to the negative, but only because they're being pushed by some outside voltage. And because of this, the conventional current flows in the other direction. So that's what you need to know about primary versus secondary cells.